So one quick task we want to do before we build a WordPress website with HostGator Web Hosting is just to change our domain name and get rid of this temporary domain right here. It says something like Gator, then your number, then temp, then domains, and then just some random letters that don't even make sense. So let's go do that, and then we can build on a real domain name that Google will like. Okay, so we're just going to go to Hosting from our portal. Then we want to get to settings. So let's click on manage. And here's settings, click settings. And then we're going to click on change domain. And I'm just going to go ahead and write in our domain name again. So we're going to write, you can do it dot tech just to make sure that we have it in there correctly, because some of you will have something different and update it. Okay. It's just going to say, you've already done that. Now in WordPress, let's go to our dashboard. Okay, log in one more time. And we're going to come down to Settings General. And we have our domain name in here too. So everything should be working. Of course, you can change it so there's a www here in WordPress address, and you would have to do that. Then you'd have to add the www in site address too. But we like it just short and simple. Let's click on our site title, and we'll actually notice that just by doing those steps, sort of a little bit of magic, that step in settings right here by changing our domain name and saving it even if it was already the right domain name, and then going ahead and checking WordPress made the domain name behave. Now we have our real domain name in here instead of our temporary domain name. So congratulations, I hope that worked, and if you found a different technique or some problems with that method, and let me know in the comments below the video.